What's up guys, it's your boy Steel Edge here, back with another one. Now in this video, I'm going to be continuing my realistic series on Yukon Valley. Now this is part 2 of 3 on Yukon Valley. I'm going to be doing all the other maps too, 3 part series on them too. Make sure to go check out the one before this one, uh, part 1. But <clears throat> make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and let's get into it. But what I need to explain first is, basically I'm just going to be doing a what the title is really just going through and making myself like acting like I'm in the game really and just being as realistic as I can while hunting so let's get into it <clears throat> all right guys it's about 5 30 in the morning and uh we've got the 12 gauge with loaded with slugs and we are gonna try to go get a grizzly bear I do have a um Oh, a tripod stand set up on the tracks and uh, I'm looking for a caribou or grizzly bear or even maybe some moose but oh there's a call from one I just heard a grizzly bear call now you gotta watch out and make sure they don't attack you cause they will and luckily for me there's no pl there's really not a lot of bison around here so probably won't have to deal with them this time so Looks like they have like a maybe a feeding zone down there. I can see some tracks down the, the side of the train tracks, but my tripod stands just right over there, as you can, may can see. Now I've got the 300 and the 30 out six also equipped in case one comes after us or we have to maybe reach out there a little farther. Because really, about the farthest shot we can take with the slugs about 170 but we can take like a 400 yarder with the 330-06 so I usually see some grizzly bears on my way or even just some kind of wildlife on my way to the stand but there's always the chance that you don't see stuff but I did hear a call. Oh, that was a moose call. If he gives me the opportunity, I might shoot him with a with a bow or something. Oh, we got some bears down there. That that one looks like our best one right now. Looks like a fairly nice male. Oh, that's a really nice caribou. I'm going to try to take him from right here. Okay. If I'm right, we're far enough away that that grizzly bear shouldn't spook. get a shot and uh, I need to calm down just a little bit this is a monster okay there's the there's the bear okay there he is oh he smoked we smoked him we smoked him if I'm right he should go down here any second oh he just went down he just went down let's go okay now I'm gonna try to take that bear out if he's still there. Hopefully he didn't run off. Ah, oh, he's running off. Nope, nope, that's not him. Okay. Okay, there's a little female ca uh, caribou. Getting some calls from the moose. Okay, I think I see the grizzly. Yes, there he is. He's still here. That's a very good thing. Okay, um, let me get a range on him. Okay, just gotta get a range and then I'll take the shot. Okay, he's right at 300 away. 
almost 300, about 295. Alright, he's 292. Alright, I'm going to try to take him. Actually, I'm going to take him with the 300. Just to get that little extra knockdown power. Down, I think I'll have to put another one in him. Missed. Oh, man. Maybe he'll come back. It's not very likely, but hopefully. Well, let's get in the stand. And I, I think I might have messed him up. But the shot I thought looked good. But I guess it wasn't. Okay. I'm just going to see if I can get another grizzly bear or caribou. Okay. Oh, there's another grizzly bear. Oh, it's just a little one, or it's just a little female. Just a small female. Maybe we can find another one. If I can't, I might take that one. Doesn't look like that grizzly bear died or anything. Right now, it doesn't. <clears throat> so, I'm just gonna sit here and I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait a little bit and see if he comes back. But I'm gonna try to take the shot on this grizzly, I've decided. Okay. It's about 330 yards, or actually I need to get a really good range on it. Before I take the shot. Oh, oh, there's another grizzly. This one's a male. It's the same one from earlier. Alright, I need to get a shot off quick on this thing. Alright, I'm gonna use the 30 6 on him this time. Got him. We got him. I think we did at least. Man. Maybe he was a little farther away than what I thought. The shot, it looked really good. I don't know really what could have gone wrong right there. I saw some, there's a grizzly bear. Grizzly bear. Okay, it's just a female. But I'm gonna take it anyway. Okay. I might try to take it with a shotgun if it's in. No, it's not. It's definitely not in range. Okay, about 270. Alright, let's, let's take it out. I'm gonna hold a little bit low. We got it. We got it. Okay, he's got it's it's going down. She's going down. She did. She did. She did. She just died. Oh, let's go. Oh, oh, here comes those. He turned the caribou back. Maybe the bear will come back with her, with them. Doesn't look like it died still. I think that's a red fox. Yes. 
it sounded it sounded just like a little female though. Okay. We still got more coming in. Maybe them them two bears will be right behind them. Hopefully we can get a really good shot on them. I thought my shot was perfect though. Oh, there's our big male. There's our big male caribou right there. Okay. Now what I'll probably do is I'll probably go get the full wheeler and then come back. There, there they are. Alright, I don't expect to see those grizzly bears coming back yet. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to camp, and I'm going to get the four-wheeler, and then I'm going to come back and get these uh, uh, two grizzly, uh, this grizzly bear and this caribou. And then... We'll just go from there. The grizzly bear I shot, he wasn't a big one, but the caribou I shot, he was a monster, an absolute monster. Oh, I just heard something over there. All right. I'm just gonna go call the four-wheeler guy and get him to bring it over. All right. I just got off the phone with him. It should be, yep, it's right here. This will be kind of risky going down this. I'll have to be pretty careful. Okay. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Okay. Okay. Well, we made it down a lot e better than what I thought we were going to. So... Go get these animals. Oh. I hate driving through the woods with this four wheeler. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go kinda walk rob the edge of the the river. And then hopefully I can see the caribou laying on the on the bank. Oh, I did not mean to do that. But if I'm correct, we sh I should be able to see the caribou laying. Okay, here's one of those females tracks. Oh, here's, here's this, here's the blood. Alright. I'm gonna go track him. This must be the bear hit. Okay. Alright, this is him coming in. Now I just gotta. Okay. Okay, this is the bear. Uh, I might just go try to walk and see if I can find our male's tracks. might kind of scope out the area just to see if I can like see him laying on the ground so oh 
Oh, there's something. It's a grizzly bear. Oh, it's a it's a big one. Sadly, we couldn't get the shot off. That was a big grizzly bear. I couldn't tell too much about him, but all I know is that he was a big one. There's a female. I hope she doesn't attack. If she does, I'm ready. Moose. Oh, oh, I think this is our, I think this is our caribou. Oh, there's a red fox. Oh, that's a male. That's a male. Sadly, I don't have a, actually, I might have buckshot. 12 gauge buckshot might be able to take him down. Yes. Yes, it will. If I can get a shot on him with a 12 gauge, that will work. Maybe this is in our caribou. I guess it's a totally different one. Okay, well I'm just gonna go back and just blood trail him. I thought I might be able to uh, just see him laying, but I'll just, I'll have to blood trail him. Oh, there's something. I think this is our bear. This is our big bear, I think. Yes. Ah, uh, I did not get the penetration I needed on those shots. I'm using the 30 out 6 next time. It wouldn't have been a huge one, though, anyway, at least. So... I'm glad we found him, though. Glad we found him. So, now, all I have to do now is just find that caribou. And then, actually, I've got that other grizzly I need to find, too. But, I know that caribou's down, because I saw it. I saw it laying there. Ooh, I'm gonna put the slugs in just in case. Just in case I have to euthanize this bear. Okay, here, oh, here's our caribou. Hit him. Yes. This is a giant caribou. Oh, yeah. I'll send him to the lodge. Awesome. Okay. I don't know how good I hit that. That bear. If it's a non-vital organ hit, he shouldn't be down. But if it is, then he should be. Okay, I think this is tracks. No, it's not. Maybe 
Maybe he is dead. I don't know, I can't tell. I wish he was coming in closer. But let me go get that other grizzly bear. I don't think I hit him very good. I don't think I hit him at all very good. Oh, I think this is his tracks. Yeah, this is his tracks. No, I didn't I didn't even hit him. I missed. Well, I'm glad I did that instead of wounding him. Okay. He'll be back. He should be at least. Let's see, our tripod actually should be up there on that bridge somewhere. There it is. It's pretty far away. But hopefully we can find this other grizzly bear. But I saw it go down, so I should be able to. I don't see why I couldn't. Ooh, we just found a, uh, while well, these bears are drinking. So, they'll definitely be back. Especially that male I shot at. He should be back. But I have seen that male before somewhere. I think, actually, in these woods. Hmm, looks like something's been drinking up here. Looks like caribou. No, that's gr grizzly bear. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna head up and look for this other grizzly bear. Because, <clears throat> especially with a four-wheeler, I, I can get there really quick. So I can, I'm gonna be able to go pretty fast. I'm correct. She should be laying somewhere over there. So she's probably about 300 yards away. Okay. I'm guessing she was probably drinking over here somewhere. Yes. Here's her blood. Let me get her track. Okay. Alright, I got her track. Okay, I'm gonna just follow all these. I hit her, uh, probably hit her in the lungs, I think. Probably single lung. Left lung is what I'm guessing. Here she is. Alright, awesome. I'm guessing I hit her in the left lung. Yes. Busted right through that shoulder blade. If I didn't hit that shoulder blade, I probably would have gotten double long. But all right, guys, that's gonna be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed, and stay tuned for the next ones coming up. Bye.